Hello, I'm Ever Browning, candidate for Maryland State Senate, District 24, Prince George's County. And as I've been going through this county, I realize we have a lot of dynamic problems that's going to require a dynamic team to make a difference. So please allow me to introduce you to the people who, with your help and your vote, will be serving you in the office of sheriff, county council, delegate, and clerk of the court. Hello, my name is Sia Fino. I am an African immigrant living in Prince George's County, District 24. I am a mother of three children, one of whom is currently deployed, a daughter attending Morgan State University, and a three-year-old. I'm also an activist, a community activist, and a businesswoman. Prince George's County is going through a great transformation, and I want to be part of it. I want to be the voice for the African immigrant community, but also I want to build the bridge between the African immigrant and the African American. When it comes to women's issue, we think alike. When it comes to education, we want the same thing for our children. When it comes to community safety, we all want to be safe. This is why I am running to be your next delegate for District 24. I would like for you to come out June 14th to the 21st, early voting. June 26th is voting day. We can't do this alone. I cannot do this alone. I need you. We all need you. Come out and support us and put us in. Thank you, and God bless you, and God bless this great United State of ours. Hello, my name is Adrian Howell, and I'm running to be your next clerk of the circuit court. I'm passionate about Prince George's County. I'm a product of Prince George's County. I'm a graduate of Howard University School of Law, and I want to really focus on making the clerk's office work for you. I want to improve customer service, efficiency, professionalism, and dedication. We're going to make sure that all aspects of the clerk's office that impact you work for you. My theme is lifting as we climb. We're going to move the agenda one issue at a time. On June the 26th, we need your support. We need a strong turnout to make this a reality. So vote for us on June 26th, and we will make sure that we will continue to lift as we climb. Thank you for your support. Hello, my name is Juanita Colbreth Miller. I'm a candidate for the Prince George's County at-large council seat. I'm a long-term resident and public servant in the Prince George's County community. I'm running for this office because I have invested in this county for many years. And with my equity, I intend to use it to make Prince George's County a great county and get you to pull out the equity that you have invested in this county. And we will do that together through education, economic development, and tax reform. On June 26, it is very important that you get out and let the county know you're casting your vote for the equity in your investment. I'm BJ Page, candidate for Prince George's County Council District 7. I want to take this time to say make sure you come out to vote on June 26, but I want to talk about something real quick. I speak for the unforgotten. It's people like your returning citizens, your underserved communities, and people that just flat out just don't come out to speak when they can. So I want to say June 26, exercise your right to vote. Keep the integrity, respect, and accountability right here at home. Come out to vote June 26. Hello, I'm Kendall Wade, candidate for Sheriff of Prince George's County. Not only do I serve as a chairman for a state public safety caucus for the Young Democrats of Maryland, but I also currently serve you as your deputy sheriff, and I've done that for nearly a decade. The scripture reminds us that no man puts new wine in an old wineskin. It said, in fact, the pressure from the wine would destroy the wineskin. So we cannot take the new issues that we're seeing as a county when it comes to drugs, weapons, and gangs, and try to apply the old way of policing to that. It is a new day, time for new leadership. With your help, together, we will make our schools safer, we will end domestic violence, and we will bring about true criminal justice reform with a concentration on reentry. On June 26, come out to vote, so we can make more service and less politics, not just a motto, but our reality. I've been blessed, as you can see, to have people around me who, like me, are dedicated to this community, to the families, to the businesses, to us moving forward. So we need you to come out to vote on June 26th because your voice needs to be heard. 
you need to show up and show out. I'm Everett Brownie and I approve this ad.